It's here. Let's open it up. Hey everyone, it's Audrey here and today we're going to open our new Sophie and Toby. Now I do know the theme because someone put it in their title on YouTube. So I do know the theme but I don't know what's in the box. So let's pop this in which end it is. Yeah, the Sorry, it's a purple box. I really enjoy the purple box as you remember and I apologise for shadow. This side is the shadow, isn't it? Because the light is coming in through the door. So I do apologise. But look, I love these boxes. I just want a collection of purple boxes to store stuff in. That's so what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna turn them purple ones and just Right, let's take a look inside. Ta -da. Yes, so this is Seascapes. I feel like there's stuff leaking out of this. Yeah, there it is, isn't there? Brilliant. I know what it is as well, but there we go. So this is Seascapes. Uh, making resin art, ocean, coaster, painting and decorations. So we'll take a look at that in a little bit. I'm going to move the box over this side. Go through. So we have got some... Oh! some gloves I'm hoping they're night trial but they don't feel oh no they do feel like night trial which is good you want to use night trial gloves over things like vinyl or latex just protect your hands better from the resin and then this really nice flexible scraper that's gorgeous that's good for scraping for mixing for so many things I really enjoy that Okie dokie, the next thing we have is a large shell. It's gorgeous. <laughs> trying to make sure that I'm not going to be defeated by sellotape. But it's not going well. Oh. Let's see. So we have this gorgeously large shell that is stunning. I can't even tell you how beautiful that is. Love it. Love, love, love. It's a bit weird having ocean things now because I spent all summer making ocean themed things. <laughs> it was great fun. Okie dokie. So we have some little plastic mixing cups. Unfortunately, no measurements on them, so you can't measure in them, but they're brilliant for mixing up colours, etc. We have a set of smaller sh Oh. 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 Now, I don't want to cut a huge hole in this because I'm going to put them back in. If I just take a little bit like that. So we've got some... And the ones. We've got a couple of these which are my favourites. Got a moderate sized shell which looks like it may have broken ever so slightly, which is a shame. Got some smaller little. Uh... Oh, that's so pretty. Look at the colours on that one. Sorry, that's those cups causing an awful trouble. Um, so then we've got some standard sort of shells as well. Same shape as the larger one. We've got a wider spiral. I mean, there is a whole heap of variety in there. Lots of different ones in there, which is super cute. And now I have a smudge at the door. Let's see if she's going to ask to go out. And then tell them how long before she wants to come back in. Because all they've been doing today is inside, outside, outside, inside, inside, outside. It's been um, raining on and off. But I thought I'd come here and film while I've got a bit of natural light. And then, uh, oh, let's go. Take a Then we have some 
tiny cups now they're cute and they've got a spout <gasps> that's awesome so you pull your cup out so you just want to mix a little bit of colour or you definitely want some precision because I often struggle with precision in harder plastic cups rather than silicon this has its own pour spout that's perfect <gasps> love this this is quite a staples box as well so what have we got we've got a b two part one to one resin there's a positive we have got some star sand a tiny jar of star sand we have got some oh some thin and some thick bezel tapes so these go on the back of your bezels to give you um sort of that seal and then you can remove it so that your resin doesn't leak everywhere apologies i have a phone call oh okay, thank you we then have this gorgeous glitter i don't know if the light turn the camera on i don't know if the light is even going to catch the gorgeousness of that glitter i'll get a picture for you it's beautiful and then we've got oh more resin more one-to-one -one epoxy resin Ooh, two bottles of resin. That's impressive. Then we have some little bottles. So we have white seascape pigment. I'm going to assume then that this is very similar to the resin 8 pigment. Because of the shadows. And the glare. I don't know if it's actually going to focus at all on it. Oh, I'll get some pictures of everything. Um, so that's for the seascape, so I'm assuming that will work like the Resonate one where it creates the bubbles for you. We've then got three colours which, I mean they came in the box upside down, you can just see those three colours are stunning. So these are Ocean Sand Seascape Pigment, so it is pigment, it's not even paint. So we've got a sand coloured one and then we have a Deep Ocean Sandscape Pigment and a Ocean Blue Seascape Pigment. They're lovely, those are all really nice bottles. We then have some little moss or seaweed, however you want to use it, and the sun goes in. We then have a cute wooden... Why am I thinking axle? Axle is not the right word. What is the word for this? Easel. And to on said easel we have this beautiful wooden board. It sits on there beautifully i really like that and i also have a circular one which will sit on too oh, i really like this this is such a cool box this would be great as a beginner as well because the amount of resin in the tubs and the mixing in the gloves this is cool so let's go through our booklet have a quick look so it is seascapes we have got uh, some different tutorials for things. So the May Creative Contest. We have our winner. And then we have our two runners up for the May Contest. And then we've got regular box items. So if you just got the regular box, you would get one set of resin. And you would get the four pigment pastes. So the white, the two blues and the sand coloured. And I'm going to store them up so I've done with that so then they live again, so I'm going to assume they need to be stored that way. You get, they are vinyl gloves. That does upset me because vinyl gloves aren't as great. Um, if they were just giving away one set, I would have said at least do a night trial set. Um, I would use these if I was doing, say, painting a mould with mica powder or possibly doing some cleaning up afterwards or I I don't my other half helps me by, by putting my resin in smaller bottles so that I can use it because my hand just can't deal with bottles of that size so it could be good for wearing it for them just to make sure you don't get sticky or anything but I'm sad they're vinyl gloves that does make me sad because vinyl gloves aren't great but hey hey Oh, okay. And then we get the pouring and the mixing plastic cup. So you get your pouring ones and your mixing ones, which I think are absolutely perfect for this. I said they're great for a beginner as well, because beginners may not have them. You also get the wooden coaster board. That is a huge coaster, I'm sorry. 
close as I get the first cup in my cupboard. I'm letting them go searching for one, literally pulling out the first cup in my cupboard. Now I'll put it on close to one edge of the coaster. I mean, that is a huge coaster. But it's also one of the best mugs. The madness hamsters. Every night they visit you, every night they come. Bit by bit they steal your brain and feed it to their mum. I do love Edward Moncton. Edward Moncton is brilliant. I have tea and coffee pots, I have everything. Well, let's use Daryl's tea that is so gross that it's not good for tea. That is just gross. Got tea bags all over it. You know, the sugar of delight. I've got tea, coffee, and sugar things. Uh, so wondrous was its sweetness that it filled their mouths with pleasure and their souls begin to quiver with delight. And I have lots of sort of coasters and things as well for them. Um, do I have any magnets? Oh, I have one magnet. I love this magnet. This magnet, I have this in coaster as well. This is like the magnet for me. So in case you can't read it, I will read it to you. It says, the law of straightness. My pencils are straight, my socks are straight, my pillow is straight, my chips are straight. Everything must be straight or else the world will explode. Asterisk. Those who do not believe in the law of straightness will not be saved. I do have a bit of a thing with organisation, making sure things are nice and neat and tidy and stuff in their way. And a certain thing with odd numbers. So yeah, that, that magnet is me perfectly. So there's our very large poster board, which that is very large. The silicon spatula, yep, yeah, that is an amazing thing to have. And then the la the wide and thin bezel tapes, which are also brilliant. So those are regular box items, yes. And then you go to the premium add-ons. You get the wooden frame with the easel. Ah, oh, okay. So it's not just a board, it is as the frame. So you could do either or both or anything else you can think of with it. Yeah, I really like that as a sort of concept. That is cute. Properly cute. Uh, you also get the moss, which is nice. The star sand and the glitter, rainbow glitter. I'm sad that the moss is an add-on and I'm sad that the shells are an add-on, really, because if you're doing seascapes, you think you'd give them at least, maybe not the big one, but this bag of shells or the big one and not these i would have thought would have been a regular box but now the shells are the thingy box and then you get another set of resin which is awesome i'm well excited by the amount of resin in that and that it has a perfect box i mean i'm easily pleased aren't i let's be fair you've then got the instructions for how to do your seascape so i'm just going to quickly look do, do, do. Tiny dab of the white, yeah, so the white does work in the same way it is designed to create the bubbles. Um, and then on the back I've got a discount code which I will pop down in the description for you. There's a couple of discount codes in there depending on whether you want to get a box, whether you just want to get some items, what you want to do. It doesn't cost you a thing if you use my code but it does really really help me out and I would be mature appreciative and yeah. Thank you very much for joining me today with our Seascapes October box and uh, I'll see you all soon. Bye!